What's going on, Coyote Pack? A couple of days ago, we released a video where we announced the Brave Adventures book tour. You guys remember that one? And I was really excited because I also had the first official copy of the book with me. But what I didn't come back to was actually looking inside of the Brave Adventures book. And I know a lot of you wrote in and said, Coyote, we wanted to see the inside, the illustrations, hear about the animals that are gonna be featured. So today, we're gonna do exactly that. So let's do a flip through real quick before we get into more of the chapters. Um, oh, look, I love this page. Check this out. Now, believe it or not, my mom actually did a lot of the illustrations that are inside of this book. And this is one of her illustrations right there of a Gila monster. Uh, the other illustrations were done by a great friend of mine named Dia, who is a naturalist and an artist. And she did a lot of the field guide sketches that are in here. People oftentimes want to know, where did my love for animals originate from? And it started when I was eight years old. And that is where this book begins. Chapter one, which is called the dragon, which is about the first enormous common snapping turtle that I ever caught. I was eight years old and it took me the entire summer, but I finally built up the bravery to jump into the water and grab onto this 50 pound giant. Now the battle was epic and the story that's described in the pages of this book, honestly, kicking off the book with this story really set the tone for what this was going to become. And it transitions from me being eight years old to me being 15 years old and traveling across the country with my mom and sister. So chapter two is called Rogue Buffalo. That's right, Rogue Buffalo. I was actually chased across the prairie by a buffalo when I was 15 years old. Now, it goes from eight years old to 15 years old and then transitions into the days of the Brave Wilderness Channel. And we introduce you to Mark and Chance and Mario and where this true journey began as the Brave Wilderness Channel launched and we started the Breaking Trail series. Our first major expedition was in the Florida Everglades. And I don't know if you guys have seen the episode, if not, go back and check it out, where I jumped on and caught a 300 pound American alligator. Remember that day, Mark? Oh man. I can, forget, honestly, right? I remember the first time you jumped on the alligator, like, I thought you were done for. Yeah, <laughs> that was pretty crazy. Now, from the swamps of the Everglades, we transition into the deserts of the Southwest, where we encounter Gila monsters, rattlesnakes, black widows, tarantulas, ooh, and the one that creeps me out, centipedes. We've had so many epic adventures in Arizona. Of course, many of those had to make the book. From the deserts, we transition to the jungles of Costa Rica, and from there, we head up to Alaska, where you guys remember the bear scare episode? One of the wildest encounters we've ever had, where we stumbled upon a mother brown bear and her three cubs. That was a very scary situation and was a very makeshift episode when we did it, but it transitioned into an incredible narrative story in the pages of this book. You remember that day, don't you, Mark? Oh boy, yep, sure yeah, do. Bear Scare was a crazy one. Actually, I love this picture here. We get to incorporate wolverines Ooh, into yeah. this chapter. All the animals of Alaska, wolverines. There's me looking out on the river. There's a cool field guide sketch right there. Now, Swimming with Giants, which was one of my favorite episodes to film, is also in this book. And that's the time when we went to Crystal River, Florida and got up close with Florida manatees. Now, that episode specifically had a lot of narration to it. So writing the chapter was really fun. A lot of cinematic prose that came into the telling of this tale where we got underwater for our first snorkeling expedition and got up close with those cute faces. You remember those manatees? Oh, man. Oh, and Dougie, is, that is, cute is, little is that manatee. I was just about to say, is Dougie in there? Oh, yeah, Dougie is in here. You you better believe it. People oftentimes ask me, what was the most difficult episode of Breaking Trail to film? The Great Salmon Adventure. No doubt. Mark, I think you remember that trek into the backcountry of Alaska and the freezing cold water and the days it took us to not only find the salmon, but also to finally be able to catch one. That chapter right here is actually one of my favorites in the book. Oh, I think that's honestly one of the coolest adventures we've had to date. Yeah, check out this one illustration that my mom did. It's, it's absolutely one of my favorites. Look at that, holding the salmon up as I'm looking through its jaws. Beautiful. Now, the 10th chapter, because there are 10 chapters in total, I'm not gonna give it away. Ooh, a what secret the chapter. Is. It's a secret chapter. It's one of my favorite chapters, and people oftentimes wanna know, what is the greatest animal encounter you have ever had? And the 10th chapter of this book truly captures that moment. And the only hint I will give is that it happened late at night in the rainforest of Costa Rica with one wild jungle creature. So Coyote, tell me what's the difference between the videos and the book? Great question, Mark. The difference between the videos and the book is the book 
really allowed me to dive into all the nitty gritty details of what it took to make these episodes. With the episodes on the Brave Wilderness channel, I write all the voiceover scripts, but I have to keep them to a limited number of words to keep the episodes moving forward. But with a book, when you're working with 10 to 15 pages per chapter, oh man, you get to put all of your vision and imagination into every single one of these pages. And of course, all these stories are based on true events, so it was very exciting to write this book. And you were you were there from beginning to end. There's no ghost writer. You wrote every page. Nope. Actually, every word on the page comes from me, and then Mark and Chance both helped me edit it. And this is a work of art for us, and we have put over a year's amount of time into the pages of these books. Actually, I started writing last September, and just coincidentally, the book now comes out available for everybody on September 12th. But remember, it is for pre-sale right now, and I just want to say thank you to every member of the Coyote Pack who's already pre-ordered a copy. Almost 10,000 copies have been sold so far, and it's not even on the bookshelves. How crazy is that? It's crazy. It's really humbling. And where do you click if you haven't pre-ordered the book yet? Oh, you can click in the link right here. But what's even more exciting than pre-ordering a book today, which I definitely recommend doing if you haven't, is that we're going to be giving away 20 autographed copies of the book because of this video. Whoa, 20? 20 sure? copies. Yes, are we sure I that many? 20 copies, man. We are doing this. I am signing 20 copies. And we're going to send them to members of the Coyote Pack. Now, to possibly be chosen to get one of those autographed copies, all you have to do is write a comment in the comment section below telling us why you love the Brave Wilderness channel and why you really want to be one of the first to read Brave Adventures. Coyote Pack, I cannot tell you and thank you enough from the bottom of my heart how much it means to have all the incredible support you guys have given us over the years. And now to share our adventures through this book is going to be absolutely amazing. If I could give a book to all seven plus million of the pack members, trust me, I would. But if you guys are quick about it now, write in the comment section below you might get an autographed copy very soon. I'm Coyote Peterson. Be brave. Stay wild. We'll see you on the next adventure. Hey, Coyote Pack. Have you picked up your tickets for the Brave Adventures Tour yet? There's only a few left, so make sure to click on this link to reserve your seats today. And remember, the tour is the only place you can find one of the exclusive Golden Adventure tickets. And don't forget, subscribe so you can join me and the crew on our next big adventure. I am so proud to have written this book and it was inspired by a lot of the adventures that we have had.